I'm delighted to be joined by Gavin Cromwell. How are you, Gavin? Good, thanks, Mark. Uh, you have a fine place here. Yeah, it's grand now, thanks, yeah. Uh, good gallop, plenty of barns and plenty of horses in, which is obviously a good thing to you. And it's been a good year for your best season so far, 55 winners so far. Yeah, great year. Um, yeah, it's been great. I would have said it. I said I'd have 55 winners this time last year. Um, I would have said you were mad, but uh, yeah, it's been going, it's been going well. Numbers, is very, numbers and winners is obviously very important, but nice horses too, which you have now as well, which is very good. Darver Star was second in Champion Hurdle, behind Honeysuckle on, at the weekend in Dublin Racing Festival, and Wolf Prince, he ran very well too in the Juvenile. Yeah, second in the Juvenile. Um, yeah, two, two nice progressive horses, and um, it's great to have horses like that, you know. I was obviously losing Nesford Allen was a big, a big knock, and uh, it's nice to have something that can compete in a greater race um, it won't be it's not, not replacing them but um, still it's nice to be able to compete at, at that level Davos Star has been a mass, massive improver for you um, you know what it takes to win a champion hurdle how, how good is he and can he improve again from the uh, weekend yeah look at he of course he can improve but he'll need to improve you know he's um, he's gone to a career high of, of 152 now um, I think Esward Allen went into the champion hurdle last year off 162 but um, yeah, look at he's going, he's going the right direction and, and um, he stays very well, which I think I really feel that you need to stay well to win a champion hurdle. So it's a good positive. Uh, Wolf Prince and he'll go to the Triumph hurdle, I'd imagine. Yeah, try, look, Triumph, Triumph for, or the Fred Winter or the Boodles as it's called now. So that, that's on on the side. Uh, handicapper gave him a couple of pounds for the other day, so um, it's probably starting to force me towards the Triumph hurdle. But uh, so we wait and we'll see what the ground is like closer to Cheltenham. Jeremy's flame is a very progressive mare for you too. She's been good. Yeah, she was disappointing at the weekend. In the mayor's um, handicap hurdle. In the mayor's handicap hurdle. Um, look at, um, obviously we, we'll have to try and get her back right and, and um, yeah, she, she might go to the mayor's novice. Um, all being well. Depends, you know, if we can get her, get her right. Another horse that I like that you have is Alpha Mix. Yeah, nice, very progressive horse as well. Um, Going the right direction now. Lovely big Scopey horse. And, um, yeah, I like him. And many more nice young horses that, that haven't ran or anything to look forward to? Yeah, look, we have a few. I won't start mentioning names and hmm. so we'll see what happens with them, you know. But uh, there certainly is a few nice young horses and we're, we're uh, still dreaming about them. Maybe maybe they're not much, but um, at the moment, we like them. That's good. And uh, Johnny Moore now is your number one rider, but you've Connor McNamara who rides for you as well, a lad who's riding very well. So it's good that the two of them are, are helping each other and riding so well. Absolutely, yeah. And uh, Breen Kane, Kane is there as well, and Connor Maxwell as well, and, and uh, Chris Timmons comes in. They're all great lads and great help here in the yard, you know. Um, very important. You're in a very good area here in County Meads where there's so many lads around. So, like you mentioned, you want to have good lads in riding the horses out for you. So, then that gives you the opportunity then to put these lads up on. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. Um, it's hard to share it out to everybody, you know. You'd love to give everybody a, uh, the opportunities and the, and the chances, but um, obviously, you know, you, you, um, you can't, they can't all try and give them a turn as best we can. But, um, Johnny, Johnny is first choice on, 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 uh, on everything, really. And, Connor Mack is riding very well. Um, but look, they're all good lads. Uh, anything can happen within a day, never mind a few weeks. A few weeks to go to Cheltenham. How many, what sort of a team do you plan on bringing over? I'm hoping um, about six. Um, okay. But look, you have to try and get them there, you know. It's yeah, it's the hardest part. Five, five weeks left. Try and keep them in one piece. 
yeah, it'd be, it's great to have have, have uh, that kind of number going. And hopefully, they're all just they're not just there to compete. They're, they'll, they'll, they'll be competitive. You know? That's good. Listen, thanks very much for having me this morning. You fab fabulous uh, yard here and a great team of horses. So best of luck for the year ahead. Thanks for having me.